Welcome to justlearnwp.com. Today we will discuss about functions.php file. What is functions.php file in WordPress and how you can edit functions.php file. The functions.php file behaves like a WordPress plugin. With this file you can add additional features and functionality to your WordPress website. You can customize different sections of your website such as post excerpt, login page or other areas of your website. Functions.php file is stored with each theme in the themes subdirectory. It executes only when in the currently activated themes directory and applies only to that theme. If the theme is changed, the functionality is lost. Each theme has its own functions file, but only the functions.php file in the active theme affects how your site publicly displays. If your theme already has a functions.php file, you can add code to it. If not, you can create a plain text file named functions.php to add to your themes directory. A child theme can have its own functions.php and if you want to create a child theme, you will have to create a functions.php file. It is required. You can do a lot of things with functions.php file. You can easily change post excerpt or length. Default length is 55 words. You can enable or disable post thumbnails, post formats, navigation menus, widget areas and others. I have installed WordPress locally. So let me show you the functions.php file. Log into your WordPress dashboard, go to appearance and click on editor. I have activated a 2017 child theme. In my child theme, you can see I have a functions.php file. I have added support for custom Google font and I have also registered a new widget area. Now you can add your custom code here. You can find a list of a lot of functions at wpfunction.me. Here you can see a function to customize admin footer. Click on preview and copy this code. Go to your WordPress dashboard. Click on editor and select functions.php file. Now you need to paste your code here. We are going to change this text. Now click on update file to save your changes. If you want to add new widget areas to your theme or want to register new navigation menus, you can use this file. You just need to paste your functions here in functions.php file. Here you can see I have installed WordPress locally. Under WP content themes folder, I have different themes. If I click on read dash green theme, you can see functions.php file. This is 2017 child theme and I have functions.php file here. Here you can see different functions, a custom Google fonts function. This function is to register a new widget area and we recently added this function to customize the footer in admin area. Now let me show you on live server. Just click on, you need to log into your hosting control panel. I can just type just learn wp.com slash cpanel to log into my hosting control panel. Type username and password. 
now click on file manager and click on www directory now go to wp dash content themes now if i click on 2016 theme here you can see functions.php file you can edit your file live on server but before editing your file live on web server download a copy as a backup so if anything goes wrong you can upload your original file or backup file i hope now you will be able to easily find and edit your functions.php file you can read more at wordpress.org codex and you can find different functions at wpfunction.me thank you very much for watching this video tutorial and please subscribe to our youtube channel for more videos